Hey everyone, it's Amadea Bailey and I am an expressionist painter and an art coach and mentor. And I'm in my studio in Los Angeles, California. It's a kind of cloudy day today. I've been painting all afternoon. And I wanted to share something with you. Uh, I was on a call this morning with one of my, the women in one of my 90 day coaching programs. And she asked me a question. She said, Amadea, when do you feel that you found your stride as an artist? And I really had to stop and think about that because honestly, I don't really feel like I've ever found my stride as an artist. I've been painting 35 years, but every time I come in and start a new painting, it's like I start all over again. I'm diving into a complete blank canvas, into the unknown, and yes, I can draw on the years of experience that I have, but I have to be present to what's going on right now. And, uh, you know, sometimes it's very uncomfortable. For instance, the last few weeks, I've been in here and I, I've really been kind of struggling like I don't like what I'm doing, I feel like I don't know what the hell I'm doing, uh, I show up because I'm committed to my process, but it's been a few weeks of really discomfort. And finally yesterday I was in here and two paintings started to come together, all the pieces started to congeal and and I felt like I was finding some thread that I could follow that made sense and it was a great feeling. So, you know, the creative process is kind of like riding a wave. Each time a big wave comes, you have to be present to all the factors that are going on in that moment. The last wave is not going to be the same as this wave. This painting is entirely different from the last painting. And if I'm fully present to this painting, then it's going to have its own journey and challenges and pitfalls and highs and lows. And part of my process is navigating through that and staying with it no matter what, even if it's two weeks of not feeling good. Because if you really do stick with it, eventually something's going to break. And when you find that place, it's very exciting and it's very gratifying and I encourage you to really stick with those places that are difficult because on the other side, on the other side is usually a feeling of deep satisfaction that you've created something authentic that's yours. So I hope my answer to her help this morning she said it did. And I hope this, this helps you uh, in your creative process. And bon courage. Sending you my love.